Hi folks, this is uh, 12 Curly Street in Roslindale. This is a seven room, uh, three to four bedroom actually, you'll, you'll see it as we go through. Three to four bedroom, uh, one and a half bathroom, single family property. It's on a .23 acre lot. It's a really nice lot, we'll, we'll go through it. Curly Street is a uh, private way. Uh, and if you look down this way, this is American Legion Highway. Um, and then you get uh, a one-way street down the other end as well. So let's, uh, let's go take a look at the property. We're going to go in through the side door. Um, I might as well give you the exterior, the exterior uh, tour first here. Uh, really large driveway. They have two cars in there right now, no problem. Probably put a lot more if you needed to. Uh, again, it, it is a 0.23 acre lot, so almost a, almost a quarter acre, which is very difficult to get in the city. Um, and it's level. It's uh, open. So if you wanted to have a little party or, or whatever, you know, you got plenty of room. You got kids, you got a dog, a few dogs, whatever. You got uh, plenty of uh, plenty of room for all those kids or dogs or both. Uh, so then this is the side yard here. Okay, this is the rear view of the house. All right, so we're gonna go in through the side door here. It's the door I usually use. Um, we're going to head right into the kitchen. All right, so kitchen has uh, new granite countertops. It's in good condition. Uh, new hardwood floors as well. They just, I think they just, I think they just installed the hardwood floors closet. Little pantry closet, I guess, and a uh, refrigerator. All right, so this room next to the kitchen here, this could be used, they're using it as a bedroom right now. This could be used as a bedroom, it could be used as an office, it could be used uh, as a nursery. Really, uh, you can use it for whatever you'd like to use it for. All right, don't mind all the stuff that the owner has in here right now. And let's go straight into the dining room and the living room. All the floors in the house are, they're all redone. And they look great. All right, and there's your front door. Okay. So, um, Curly, Street, Curly Street is a pretty, it's relatively quiet. Uh, not a, well, not a lot of traffic um, coming through. There's really no reason for it. Uh, you know what we're going to do here now? We're going to go look at the uh, half bath on the first floor here. Okay. And it's got hardwood floors in the half bath as well. So, all right. So let's go take a look upstairs. And on the second level here, we have three bedrooms and one full bath and we'll take a look first we'll take a look at the rear right hand side of the property this is going to be the smallest bedroom on this level and I would say it's probably nine by ten I would say okay all right and then we'll go to the rear left of the property, and this is a really good size bedroom, I will say. All right, rear yard back there, three windows. So, you know, again, uh, good size bedroom. I would say that this is probably 13 by 14. I'm just guessing, haven't made any measurements. And here's your front left. Bedroom, I, you know, quite honestly, you could, you, 
you could use either this bedroom or the bedroom that we were just in as the master. I think most people would probably use this bedroom as the master. But everybody's different, so. I think they're just about the same size. All right, so we'll go into the full bath on this level. All right. The original looks like the original tile floor. Okay. Shower. Toilet. Vanity. All right. And what we're going to do next is we're going to go upstairs into the attic. And this attic is unfinished. It's very steep stairs, almost like a ladder. But we'll come up here anyway and take a look. You know, in case somebody ever got the bright idea of finishing it off. It's a really big space, front to back space. Um, it is hot, I will tell you. All right, we're gonna head downstairs. See, this is how steep the stairs are. So you gotta go up and down. We gotta go down backwards anyway. Or I have to go down backwards. All right. And slowly. All right, so we're gonna get, we're getting ready to finish up this tour. Last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna head down into the basement. And uh, there's actually a full bath in the basement that I haven't mentioned in the listing uh, sheet. I may change that. Right now I have it listed as a one and a half bathroom. I, may, I might change it and change it to a two and a half bathroom. Okay. Although I would probably get some grief from some buyers because they're gonna say that the, the, the other full bathroom is in the basement. The heating system, uh, it's a gas heating system. It's brand new, it's a Burnham. I know you can't really see it, but it's in great shape. Electrical panel, circuit breakers, 100 amp service. All right, uh, wash and dryer, they have it. They just put it back down here. And uh, let's go take a look at this. Well, they should put that toilet seat down. I'll put it down for them. All right, see, there we go. So a little vanity there, shower. Up oh, there it is. And uh, all right. And then they have a little room down here. It's only about six feet high, I would say. Ah, I'm six. I'm five eleven. So they have some of their stuff, some storage down here. Five eleven. So it's probably like six two. The ceiling heights. They do have heating down here, actually. Forced hot water heating down here. Okay, and they actually have a heating, uh, well, it's actually a heating zone as well. So, all right, so anyway, this is, uh, this is my tour of 12 Curly Street in Roslindale. Again, it's a single family property and, and it's on a uh, 0.23 uh, acre lot, which is almost a quarter acre. And uh, that's it. I thank you for your time and uh, have yourselves a good day. Take care. Bye-bye.